$24 to get your laundry done to look like a cube and folded by a nice lady. But I don't like that. That's too expensive. But what I'm going to do today, I'm going to go to the Statue of Liberty. Yep. And that was like $19 with no tax, so I'm pretty happy about that. So let's go do that. Absolutely wonderful day to watch, look, see the Statue of Liberty. We are hustling and bustling here in New York. I passed the station like three times. I went by it, see the Statue of Liberty, and, and then I did a circle because I don't look. But we're here. That's annoying. I hate when I do that. You just pass something that you need to go to. Are you a stairs or escalator person? I usually take the stairs. That is where I need to go. Cool, let's see, let's see the statue. It's a beautiful day. Look at how clear the sky is. What a beautiful day. So look at our nation's liberty of freedom. Or what we used to think freedom was. Nah, we're still free. Still pretty damn free. Because I can do this and no one's going to yell at me. So, we're free. I can see it. I can see it. It's right, right there. I'm not going to show you yet. It's right there. I'm going to get a little bit closer. Cavity search coming. It is quite shaky on the boat. I want to know if anyone's going to puke. I feel like someone might. This is shaky. It's kind of windy out today too, so maybe, maybe we'll topple over. I don't know. There she is. There she is. Our Statue of Liberty. As per usual, with things I do, I didn't read anything. I didn't think you actually get to be on the island, the Liberty Island. I just thought they, you were near the water and then you just passed it. But no, look at you. There's so many seagulls, I don't want to get pooped on. And they're squawking at everybody, but it's right there. Also a thing I didn't realize, there's so many helicopters. You know, the billionaires, they have to get to Manhattan. Damn, Lady Liberty looks pretty today. There are days you can go onto Liberty Island and see this, but it's a beautiful day. Nice, clear, blue skies. Man, New York has been treating me very well with this nice weather. Just lovely people here. One might want to move here, I can see why. All right, now I'm going to get back on a boat and go back to Manhattan. I 
I love that they have a tree in the middle of the walkway. Shows that life can go even through concrete. But I think, I think we're gonna go to the One World Trade Center right now. Let's go. Oh, I didn't even know this was here. Look, we got the bull, the bull. Big old cojones, this thing. <laughs> Big balls. And the bull head. Look at that. Whoa. There's a curb there. Look at all these people. Want to take a picture in front of a bull. What losers. The One World Trade Center is a very cool area in which they've totally transformed this place into a place where everyone can, you know, there's just so much to do here. They've made it into its own little campus. And I think that's great that with such tragedy comes such great, you know, like a response that's very American of us to take tragedy and make it into something beautiful and something that the world has never seen. And as much as it was extremely tragic, what happened, what came out of it, it's beautiful. And that's the only way to do it. You can't let that thing, uh, let things like that beat you down. And one could take that into their life. Just because you don't get the job or something bad happens to you, that doesn't mean you can't make something absolutely beautiful out of it. And I think we did a pretty good job of that. <clears throat> if anyone is familiar with the, um, the art museum, the Calatrava in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, this looks very much like it. This is the Oculus. It looks very identical in terms of concept and design. Still beautiful, all white. Also, it's a train station too, and a mall, and probably a food court too. This thing is really cool. Let's find this train, which I know is impossible to find. Let's see if I can find it. Last time it took me like 25 minutes to find it. It's it's right here. It was right here the whole time. That's not it. That goes downtown. I want to go uptown. Last time took I want to say 25 minutes to find it. This one took four seconds. I don't know why I had to do all that walking, but to uptown we go. This thing goes up so quickly. I mean, it's only eight floors, but it's got this big mirror, which is really cool. You get to look at yourself, fix your hair, while you wait for it to open. And we're back. Hey, if you're wondering why there's like another video on my page, it's because uh, there's a guy named Ryan, he's a broker in New York, and he's giving away a year's free rent in New York, 
and that was my video to see if I can try to get it. Uh, it sounded like a cool idea, so that's why that other video is there. So a couple of you saw it, and it probably makes no sense whatsoever, and maybe even looks stupid. But whatever, I tried. We'll see. All right, bye.